What's up everybody? It's your girl Ebony Jean. Welcome to my channel if you're new. If you're a current sub, you welcome back. I am doing a Makeup Geek unboxing. Well, I like to call this a farewell unboxing because Makeup Geek is officially closing its doors at the end of April, which I am very, very sad about. I'm going to open all this stuff together like I haven't touched anything. So, it came in this big box. Here is the greeting card they sent over and it has all the signatures from the entire staff including Marlena. Uh, she's been up here in Michigan for the past couple of weeks trying to finalize everything and I really wanted to meet her but it's all good it's okay. So it says hi Ebony thank you so much for everything we wish you all the best. You inspire us all. Love always the makeup geek team. Oh, tear. Oh my goodness that is so sweet. Um, I love you guys so 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 much. You all are incredible. Thank you for everything you've done for me. I'm going to miss working with you all. I have a lot in this box. So we're going to open this together and I have my matrix palettes with me along with an empty vault palette. Um, they just sold out of that stuff by the way and Makeup Geek is selling everything for 40% off right now so please grab what you can because once it's gone and ain't coming back well. So first I have the dark brown brow duo. I have a pencil in like the retractable form and to sharpen and I need to stock up on this because I'm actually running low on my brow pencils. Um, my black eyeliner pencil this right here this came right on time because I just ran out of my other one from Makeup Geek. And I have some lashes. I don't have on any of theirs today, but here's Fearless and Elegant, two of my favorite styles. I was trying to get more of the 3D lashes because uh, my favorite style in that is Ava, but they sold out of that quickly. So I was able to get those. I have some blushes. Did anyone else have this fetish as a kid? Like you would take the bubble wrap and just start popping it. I still do that sometimes, but maybe it's just me. I don't know. Oh, oh, what? Wait, wait, wait a minute. Okay, so I have two blushes and a highlighter. The first blush is Desire. Absolutely gorgeous on deeper skin tones. Oh my gosh, and I love how the logo is imprinted. This is called Chivalry, like my go-to blush because I love the golden undertones. Finally, we have a Blaze Highlighter. These are all of my personal favorites, by the way. Makeup Geek created a VIP page for me um, back when they were helping me out with my Alopecia Awareness Giveaway last September. And on that page, I listed all of my favorite products from Makeup Geek. And you can find all of those on that page. Um, if you're on my Instagram, you can go into my link tree. And it's like right there. So yeah, I've added that on the website and I thought it was really cool. These power pigments. And I've been waiting for this stuff to come. Because it's selling out very, very fast. First I have Dedicated. Then Unleashed. Which is like, a, like kind of like a plum pink. I have Dynamic. That gorgeous orange. I don't have any orange in my kit. Next we have Courageous, which, which is another plum. It's a little bit lighter than Dedicated. Invincible. I love purple. I'm trying to get into more purple shadows. Then I have Indestructible, which is a cobalt blue. Tenacious. Oh, I've been waiting for Tenacious to come because I've seen a makeup look on Makeup Geek's website. And I want to recreate it. But I have to get the other shadow that young lady used. So, um, yeah, Tenacious is a gorgeous turquoise, teal, however you want to put it. Finally, we have Untouchable. Then I have the signature shadows. I have Pinky Promise. Mystical, which is their foiled eyeshadow. That's really, really pretty. It's like a, a shimmery plum purple. And then Flamethrower. For some reason, I thought I had this in my kit already, but I don't. It's like a deep bronze, like a copper tone. I got their Daily Planner. This is really pretty. They came out with this at the beginning of the year. And 
I was going to buy it, but I already had an agenda. So what I'm going to do is use this for my content planning, although we're like three months into the year already. I still want to use this for my content. So it just says, dream bigger, shine brighter. On this first page, it lists all the holidays and an important date section for you to write down everything that you need. Boxing Day in Canada, that's really cool. I never heard of that before. So, uh, yearly goals. I like this page because it breaks everything down. So, habits to break, places to explore, new skills to learn, th new things to pay, or new things to try, not pay, <laughs> and my goals. So, I'm probably going to transfer everything I wrote in my other content planner into this one. And I really like this page. It says, makeup magnifies the beauty that already exists. All things are possible with a great set of lashes. That's cute. Yeah, so every month comes with a to-do list, important dates, notes, self-care, and thankful for. This is my vault palette. So these are all the new foiled shades they came out with a while back. And I was trying to get a couple more, but they sold out of them very quickly. What I'm going to do is put my blushes and my other shadows in here and I'll show you guys when I'm done. I'm all done with my vault palette. I decided to put all of my shadows and blushes in here and I have all of my foiled shadows on my right side, your left, along with the power pigments and quads. So I had them set up in quads. I really... I'm really 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 upset that the yellow and the green pigments are gone like I cannot get those at all so um, that those are the only two colors missing from my power pigments and then in my mini vault palette I have pinky promise I'm sorry this is pinky promise and a Tuscan Sun and I really like this palette because it's interchangeable all these are interchangeable but it's travel size on top of that I can swatch out my looks because Makeup Geek has on their website a page full of tutorials and the color combinations where you can um, you know, try different things for the week or their look of the week. I think it's really cool so I use this palette to swap out my colors. I really want to thank Makeup Geek again for this incredible opportunity of representing their brand. Thank you all for these lovely products. I will forever stand by these shadows. Marlena, you are an icon. I pray all the best for you and your Makeup Geek team in future endeavors. Thank you to everyone who's been using my promo code over the years. I really appreciate y'all so, so, so much. Um, those commissions really helped me out in difficult times. So thank you very, very much for your support on that. If you are looking for cruelty-free makeup, please go to Makeup Geek's website. Everything is 40% off right now. Grab what you can. But I can tell you right now that the empty vault palette along with the color and the neutral matrix palettes are sold out so whatever is left on the website is available i just applied to be a part of sephora squad this is my fourth year uh, running for this opportunity I made it as a finalist last year but they did not select me as a squad member so it will really mean the world to me if you could leave a testimonial the sephora squad link is right in my description box all you have to do is tell sephora why you think i should be on their team for 2022 if you enjoy my content if i've brightened your day encouraged you inspired you in any way now is the time to let sephora know that so please make sure that you are leaving a testimonial for me i pray that we get into the program this time it is amazing i love what they do for content creators you're more than welcome to share it on social media so um make sure to tag me in your insta stories so i can thank you or if you comment below in this video i want to thank you guys for that as well let's win it this time i'm doing this for the alopecia community the bald community and of course support black content creators don't forget to thumbs up comment down below subscribe and i will talk to y'all later god bless thanks again for watching this video Bye.